What's going on guys? I'm Chris with Palmer Aquatics and fish aquariums are my life. My house is completely filled with fish tanks. Uh, today's video is on silver dollar fish tank mates. What are the best suitable fish to be keeping with your silver dollars? I first want to talk about how skittish and timid silver dollar fish actually are. A lot of people think they can be kept with cichlids quite confidently, but in this tank here you will see that it's not going so smooth. A lot of times you can tell when a silver dollar fish is super stressed because the front of its mouth is super beat up and that's actually from the fish stressing out and swimming into the side of the glass it sounds really sad but it's completely true and that's what happens with these fish so when choosing tank mates it's actually a pretty big deal that we get this right you can see that one right there the front of its face is actually really beat up and yes it is said that silver dollar fish can be kept with cichlids you know tiger barbs um, all kinds of different cichlids as you can see in this tank but looking back on this this scenario I probably would not keep silver dollar fish in this scenario again I know that a lot of the guides on the internet are going to tell you that it's okay to keep them with Oscar fish and other large cichlids because they're essentially a dither fish and I have to disagree with that I've kept silver dollars with all kinds of different cichlids and especially Oscar fish and I will say they look super anxious and unhappy when they're in there. This guys, right here, this is the tank setup that you ideally want. This is the perfect scenario for your silver dollar fish. We're talking general community fish that are peaceful. We have giant Daniels, we have some turquoise rainbow fish. All types of different rainbow fish are going to be an excellent choice. Let's get this USB cord out of the way. Um, what else is in here? We have live bears. We have tetras. Um, don't forget that a, the silver dollar fish is actually a close cousin to all of the other tetras. Same with the piranhas. A lot of people don't know that. It is close family to them. You know, ideally, they would love to be with a bunch of skirt tetras. Those are like their best friends. It's like a, a miniature version of a silver dollar fish. And we all know how much fish love planted aquariums. Do a 55-gallon planted tank. So the best choice for tank mates for your silver dollar fish are going to be those community fish. I've said it like five times now. Molly fish, guppy fish, garami fish, rainbow fish, tetra fish. Um, there's tons of super docile fish. Maybe blood parrots. Blood parrots are kind of on the uh, the more relaxed side of cichlids. Or maybe like some fire mouse cichlids I can maybe get down with. But most cichlids in general are tend to be pretty aggressive. Maybe electric blue acaras. Here's a perfect example of one of my buddy's tanks back in the day, and he's got two Oscar fish with silver dollars. You can kind of see the behavior in the silver dollars and how they're just kind of unsatisfied and unhappy because they're nonstop kind of darting back and forth on the sides of the tanks. Um, and a lot of a lot of people might argue, well, that's what silver dollars do, you know. Um, if you watch the fish and kind of just get an idea of how happy they are by their actions, this is not like watch the behavior like they are just uh, these fish are always stressed out and it's sort of important to be aware of that to give them hiding spots I really truly believe that's where the plants come into play um, and also just being with fish that are more suitable to kind of uh, more compatible to be to be swimming with them to shoal with them you know because these fish like to be in groups when you buy silver dollars never buy one of them buy a bunch of them buy as many as you can and they're going to be more confident in the group that's kind of how piranhas and tetras are as well all right guys i'm gonna be done preaching on this one i know that i ramble on here and get super preachy and it gets annoying and you're like just give me the fish you know but uh i truly do i'm super passionate about these fish and you know if not kept with the right fish or the right scenario fish their immune systems just go to crap really fast and these fish die really fast i've seen it happen over and over um, please guys though hit up the comment section let me know what's going on are you keeping silver dollar fish are you looking to keep them with other fish uh, what size tank do you have them in uh, are you are you trying are you trialing live plants please tell me you are um, let me know in the comment section all right guys um, yeah silver dollar tank mates